On his last day as the CGI, Justice N.V. Ramana is set to make a big splash. On August 25th, around 11.30 p.m. at night, the Supreme Court Registry updated the court cause list. As a parting gift, CGI decided to deliver five high-profile case verdicts. The Apex Court for the first time live-streamed the proceedings of the ceremonial bench in Ramana's court and his farewell speech. Here's all you need to know about the 48th CJI. On April 24, 2021, Justice Ramana succeeded Justice S.A. Bobre as the 48th Chief Justice of India. Born in an agrarian family in Andhra Pradesh, Justice Nuthalapat Venkat Ramana enrolled as an advocate in 1983. In 2000, he became a permanent judge of the Andhra Pradesh High Court. He served as the acting Chief Justice of the Andhra Pradesh High Court for three months in 2013. The same year, he was elevated as the Chief Justice of the Delhi High Court. And in 2014, he became a judge at the Supreme Court. During his eight-year term, he was a part of 657 benches and delivered 174 judgments. Value to Women's Housework In January 2021, a Supreme Court bench involving Justice Ramana ruled that a woman doing housework is no less than a husband's office work. Justice Ramana has said that the housewife need to be paid on the basis of services rendered by them in the house. Internet Shutdown in Kashmir Post the abrogation of Article 370 in Jammu and Kashmir, while hearing the petitions related to the internet shutdown, Ramana noted that the internet cannot be stopped and that a periodic review must be done. The court also observed that prohibitory orders under Section 144 of the CRPC are not to be imposed in order to suppress the legitimate expression of freedom of speech, including the right to internet within Article 19 of the Constitution, 50% representation for women in judiciary. While addressing a women advocates of the Supreme Court, Justice Ramana called for 50% representation for the women in judiciary and supported the demand for similar measures in law colleges across the country. of pending cases. The outgoing CGI is leaving behind a vast case load. Pending cases during CGI Ramana's tenure rose to more than 71,000 in 2022. Not only the routine case numbers went up, but also the number of constitution bench matters shot up from 444 in 2021 to 492. Today, the number of the constitution bench matters pending before the Supreme Court have been rising. Thus, the next CGI will have a lot on his plate to start with. Growing concern post sedition order While many have applauded the Supreme Court's move on the implementation of sedition law, which was put on a temporary hold, post suspension, there was no discussion, neither the court laid down any guidelines for the centre to follow. From the date I joined, bench, I reached the highest possible position in the judiciary. I have subjected to conspiratorial scrutinies. My family and I suffered in silence. But ultimately, the truth will always prevail. Satyamaya Vajayate. If you like this video, then like, share and subscribe to Mirror Now.